They're art dealers, contractors, and software engineers. And that's how they make their livings. But when that alarm goes off, they risk their lives for free. The men of Muir Beach Volunteer Fire Department might have to wear hand-me-down turnout coats and ride around in a 25-year-old pumper truck, but when they roll out of that old wooden barn they call a firehouse, they don't lack for guts or dedication. One of the houses uh, just down the road caught fire um, about one in the morning and we uh, responded. I was one of the four guys to, to respond and be on scene. Woodacre 660 and 676 on drill and service area. And it's a good thing he and the other volunteers were there. Muir Beach is a community of only about 450 people. It's isolated along the Marin County coast. County fire crews could be 15 or more minutes away depending on weather and traffic. Those few minutes often mean the difference between life and death. Especially if you're talking about someone who's had a heart attack, someone who's taken a bad fall, is having a hard time breathing. The department's new chief, Steve Wynn, is inheriting an old problem. How to keep the volunteer fire department up and running amid dwindling state resources and limited local funding. Your basic turnout, uh, which is jacket, pants, helmet and gloves, you're talking about $4,000 per guy. Then there's trucks, then there's all the other uh, equipment, extrication equipment that we need. Compounding the problem is the fact that Muir Beach is a popular area for hikers, bicyclists, and beachgoers. Up to a million people a year who all too often need help. Woodacre 660 responding. There's a lot of falls, heart attacks, uh, issues that happen out on the beach or we got to pull people off the trails who are out mountain biking or hiking. But there is a way for visitors to the area to give something back. Every Memorial Day, locals here throw an old-fashioned barbecue open to the public to raise money for their volunteer fire department. It's a family event, and this close-knit community can't afford to be without these family members. We're a long ways away from, uh, from any outside help, and it could get a lot worse if uh, a Earthquake, even a, a good uh, fire could seal this community off uh, completely. 